Hello, this is uh, Dr. Zhang's time. Again, I would like to share some questions from the patient from my daily uh, interaction with our patients. So today the topic is about uh, what is the day five stage embryo and what is the day six, day seven, and what's the chance this embryo is going to make a baby. So <clears throat> when egg, they see the egg, meet with a sperm, Then the egg will be fertilized. That's called a 2 pn embryo. 1 pn from this nuclear, 1 pn from the sperm head. Then next day, it becomes 4 cells. Next day, become about eight cells, and next day become more order. You can see the cell number. And about day five, it reached to blastocyst stage embryo. This is called a trophectin cells, we call a T cell. This is called IC in cell mass. And this field, water, this is called a day five embryo, sometimes we call blastocyst stage embryo. Okay. However, sometimes the embryo may take six days to reach the day five stage. Sometimes they may take seven days to reach to blastocyst. So this day six, day seven are all blastocyst stage embryo. But day six means this five day old embryo takes six days to make. This day seven means this five day embryo takes seven days to make. Now, if it takes a long time, it actually indicates the quality of the embryo may reduce and reduce chance to get pregnant. So sometimes patients don't have much confidence and even the doctor's day seven embryo is not so good. So may even discard or give up. However, all the study and in our data show this day seven embryo still can make an absolutely healthy live birth baby, but the chance is reduced by 30%. So it means that the day seven embryo, if they made it to that stage, they still can make babies, but the chance is about 30% below day five and day six. Day five is almost no different. So this is the information I would like to share with you because that's the question I always get from my patients. Okay, if you have a question, give us a call, give us an email. Take care, bye.